This lesson is about catapults and levers. There's a first class, second class, and third class lever, depending on where the fulcrum moves. So I'm gonna explain that real quick. So these are things I've gathered around the house. These round cylinder shaped things are my fulcrums. Spoon, pencil, different types of pens, PVC pipe, and a spool of thread. They are going to work to catapult these balls of foil. As you can see, I made a small one and a big one. You could also use cotton balls, pom-poms, anything that is round. If you really wanna go crazy, use some rocks, but maybe wear goggles. <laughs> so I have here a ruler and a book. This is just to show you again, this does not have to be complicated. So if I take this highlighter, that is the fulcrum. The fulcrum is the part of a lever where this balance is on. So if I take this, and I put my object here, depending on where this is on the ruler, it depends on how it's gonna hit. So if I take this and bang, of course, that almost hit my ceiling. All right, so the question is, when you change the size of the fulcrum, what happens to how far it goes? That one went higher. That's because the bigger diameter of the fulcrum, the higher the object is gonna go. Now let's keep that same fulcrum and let's do the big ball. So again, you wanna ask the kids, I wonder what happens with the big one or the small one? So if I put this on here, it went high, but it didn't. It only went about half as high because it's bigger and heavier. So a book, the reason I have a book here is because you can also use a book for catapults. So I put that there. And again, I'll put this one here. Of course, they're gonna love the smaller one because it goes higher, but it definitely works. So again, in this case, the wider the book, the bigger the book, the smaller it's gonna go because it takes more effort to lift it. So again, I've got all these things. Now just think, think big. If you have PVC pipe at home, which we all do, the bigger the PVC pipe, the bigger the experiment can be. So if you have a piece of PVC pipe that's this big in your garage, go for it. Just use a piece of wood or find anything outside. If you don't, have any of these, or if you want to go on a nature walk, gather different sticks. They work really well as fulcrums too. And what? It does not have to be complicated. So along those lines, if I use this spool of thread, just have fun. Do lots of comparison for older kids. You can chart your different things, big, small, measure the diameter, see how high it goes. But just to show you the bigger the gun, that actually hit the ceiling. <laughs> Have fun with it.